when I was 22. For a year, we were very happy, and then, then, all the pieces. She became convinced that I was the Grand Central Station. You can't imagine how inconvenient it was. Well, it must have been. Very sad. Since then, she's had to remain in a... in a... Don't say it. I know the story. I don't remember telling you to. No, you never did. But good stories get around, Henry, when they're told often enough. It's your standard alibi when you're threatened with marriage, isn't it? Julia, I'm going to be completely honest with you. Wait. Let me fortify myself. Now. You see, the very thought of marriage repels every one of my finest instincts. You haven't, any. You're right, I haven't. <laughs> Lucky for me, because that's why you like me. I don't. Oh, yes, you do. You like me because I'm thoroughly bad, and you're a good woman. If I were that, Henry, I'd never have listened to you. You never really have. Oh, well, yes, I have. I've listened, and I've listened. But what I was listening for, I never heard. Well, I've said it often enough. No, no, you haven't. Oh, you couldn't, Henry, because you see you don't. Do you? Of course I do. No, not really. Let's be honest. Why is 